Welcome to this divine wine tip on daytime. I'm Stacy Medlinski from Groovy Grapes in Ottawa, and today I'm going to tell you about how to pick the perfect cocktail party wines. Now, if you're throwing a cocktail party and you want to throw it like a pro, you have to have a little bit of selection, and you also want to pick wines that are food friendly, that go with lots of finger foods and canapes, but you also want them to be tasty on their own. You want to have at least one white and one red. So here I've got some recommendations for you. First, for the whites, we've got dry Riesling. Now dry Riesling has lots of tangy acidity, it's really food friendly, and it's quite tasty on its own. It's got nice peachy citrus flavors. Next, we've got Sauvignon Blanc. Sauvignon Blanc is very food friendly, it's very popular, it's very tasty on its own, and New Zealand is making some fantastic Sauvignon Blancs these days. And we've also got an unoaked Chardonnay. Unoaked, all that means is that it hasn't been aged in oak barrels, so you're getting just the pure flavor of the fruit. So it's really fruity, really easy to drink, and very food friendly once again. And moving on to the reds, my first choice is Merlot. Merlot is just easy drinking, it's got flavors of berry and plum, and it's pretty food friendly as well, so that's a great choice. If you want something a little bit different, I recommend Rioja. Now Rioja is a region in Spain, and they use Grenache and Tempranillo grapes, so it's a really nice, uh, a different choice instead of Merlot, and it's also available at really great prices. And of course, we've got our crowd-pleasing Shiraz. You can't go wrong with Shiraz. Now here are a few tips to throw a cocktail party like a pro. First, rent your glassware. It only costs a few dollars a dozen and it saves so much hassle. You don't have to worry about running out of glassware and you don't have to do dishes once your party is done. Second, buy lots of ice. I know when I host a cocktail party, I always run out of space in my fridge. So if you buy a lot of ice, you can throw it into bins, coolers, and chill your white wine there and not waste space in your fridge. And finally, for a stylish way to greet your guests, pick up a couple bottles of sparkling wine, throw in a dollop of cassis or raspberry wine into the flute, top it with your sparkling wine, and you've got yourself a classy cocktail. Thanks for watching, enjoy the rest of daytime, and cheers.